Yo, what's up everybody? This is your boy Kwan CB and welcome back to my channel. If you are new, welcome to my channel. That's good. That's good. That's good. What's up, CB Squad? I'm back with another reaction video. Today's video I'm reacting to Tammy Roman got hands, according to Shawnee O'Neal and herself, Best My Wives LA. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you don't, give it a thumbs down. Y'all know why, I really don't care. It's just you too. Also, if you want to see more reaction videos from me, make sure you guys go on my channel and check out my videos. And if you like my videos, Click the subscribe button for more. And also, comment down below what you guys want me to react to, and I will get to it. What you got friends to do? Let's get into this video. Yo, Basketball Wives LA. Put your hand up again. Put your hand up Damn. again. Damn. Put your hand up again. Put your hand up again. <laughs> you are nine motherfuckers out of the bitch. Ooh, damn. Tell <laughs> me bad, though. Tell me bad, though. Can we got here? And now to be a fight. People still feel <laughs> that, I, that I have the same qualities. But I think that I've grown a lot and I've matured a lot. And I'm definitely not the Tammy that entered into the Miami situation eight years ago. Damn, eight years? I don't have a problem with two stamps. The issue was don't act like you don't know. Don't act like you don't know. You know, if I have to go over my situation with Jennifer, I think. Her saying that she didn't know what a food stamp was, I just thought that was a lie. I feel like how the fuck you know what a food stamp was. Thirty some odd, some odd years to actually have to seek public assistance myself. But in growing up, I knew people who were on food stamps. Like exactly. you've your entire life and never met anybody who was in that particular situation. So I don't know. I just yeah, she got to be lying. What you know caused me to be heated. <laughs> I might have been standing about 10 feet away and made my way as that Sunny. argument got louder. Once it got almost physical, I remember just trying to hold Tammy back. I ended up grabbing Tammy's shoes that she had taken off. I'm carrying shoes and pushing Tammy all at the same time. You know, that particular time in my life, I was recovering from a hardship and I was a completely different person. You, my man, when I was married to him, you Damn, can't just say that I up. didn't know you was married to him. It's not a motherfucker on this planet that didn't know that Kenny Anderson was married. I, didn't. I really thought that Evelyn and I were cool. So that was our final night of taping. A lot of people don't know that. We had just come back from our cast trip. And I was sitting out enjoying my cigarette. She came out to me, and in my mind, I thought she was going to say, you know what, I'm going to keep it real with you. I really don't vibe you. I don't like you. And then she said she slept with me. Damn. People think that I was upset with Evelyn for sleeping with Kenny. That is totally, like, 100% opposite of what that moment was. I felt like Evelyn and I had been around each other for six months of taping. We had shared a lot of moments, a lot of private situations and I felt like there were plenty of opportunities for tell to, for her to tell me that she had been involved with Kim. And well, so know, I was upset they, with they, that. They I felt like nervous. you could have told me this a long time ago. People think I was mad at her for sleeping with Kenny and I was like, find the bitch that didn't sleep with Kenny. That's the person who's gonna impress me. So it wasn't about her, you know, being sexually involved with Kenny. It was really more about I felt that we had a camaraderie and a friendship and I felt like in that situation, she could have told me earlier on. When it got real, real, real fast, I was sitting right in the middle of them. After our argument, Evelyn and I had a mutual understanding of who the other person was. 
I wouldn't necessarily call it a friendship, but I feel like we had a mutual respect and understanding for each other. I need to hear you. <laughs> Damn. I have to tell you honestly with me, I don't know. This dumbass friend, man. I, that night and I, I hate this told, dumbass friend I had carpet. This is real. It just pissed me off and sent me to the moon, and I didn't know how to come back other than pop. Damn, she's going to see me. And so yeah. that's the escape route that I took. But um, I do feel sorry for that moment in all of the instances on basketball. This dumbass fucking trash. Shut up! That's the one time that I was like, I see you shut know, up, right? that wasn't right. You know, Mika and I have had our misunderstandings, our disagreements, <laughs> but that wasn't the course of action that should have been taken. I remember sitting, it was Mika, Tammy, I want to say Susie, then myself. So... Yeah, I'm just a couple feet away from that one, too. And I've since apologized <laughs> to her, and she has accepted my apology, and we're actually cool now. So I, I'm thankful that, you know, she saw beyond that moment. In case you don't know, you done f***ed up. Because you don't want to f*** with me. You don't want me on your damn bad side. I don't want to fight with you. I know you don't. That's why the f*** you should have said nothing. Any bitch that don't want to get it popping should keep their mother mouth closed. <laughs> That's rule number one. Scary bitch 101. Let me just say this. <laughs> Scary I did bitch not take Keisha's into heat. I was helping Keisha. Keisha and I got into an argument and she hit the ground running. And everybody packed up and was leaving the location. And I looked back and saw her purse and said, oh, my God, she left her purse. Let me get her purse for her. Now, the only thing I wanted her to do was be a stand-up woman and to ask for her purse back. If she had just done that, that whole moment in Tahiti would never have existed. We were sitting in some, like, hut bar type situation, having tequila shots, which I will never give Tammy again in my life. And... That one was kind of, we saw it happening. We didn't know what was going to happen, but literally Tammy's eyes just started turning red, and she just turned into somebody else. That was definitely Evelyn and I were, you know, getting her full and probably shouldn't have, and it turned out to be a shit show. I felt like she was talking a lot behind the scenes, saying a lot of things to the other ladies that she could not say directly to my face, and I wanted her for one time to just stand up and be 100. And, and she wasn't able to do that. And it turned into what became, you know, people thinking that I'm a bully and I'm totally not that person. Let me just say, I really don't like taking a cash trip because I know that it's always going to be something. And I felt like in the United States of America this season, I told everybody, I don't want to be around us. So now you're basically forcing me to go to Portugal and be around somebody that I know is going to you know, affect me greatly and end up being in a detrimental situation for me. I was sitting at a table and Tammy, Duffy was kind of popping off at the mouth. Tammy walked away, which I was so very proud of her at that moment. And she starts walking back. I'm thinking Tammy is going to sit down and she keeps going around the table. And all I could think was like trying to push my chair back and get in her way, which what gets in Tammy's way? And, you know, all help us. I tried to grab Tammy's braid and snatch her back. That didn't quite work. I feel that there's nothing about Latasha Duffy that I actually like. Having, you know, from, from the situation in Portugal on to this present day. I don't respect her. I do not like her. I don't choose to be around her. <laughs> Let's just be clear that there's not any time it's of the day bar. within any year that if we squared up, that you would beat my ass. Tammy thought she was a real, she seemed so real. I'd be, I'd be seeing her Instagram videos where she'd be speaking about things. It's like she's so genuine, though. I, 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 she ain't the one to be fucked with. And I fuck uh, Tammy for that. It's like, it's like she be my, my mother slash auntie. <laughs> I got respect for Tammy. 
video. Wow! <clears throat> but if you like this video, give a thumbs up. If, if you don't give a thumbs down, I don't know why we don't care. Just YouTube. And also, if you want to see more reaction videos from me, make sure you guys comment down below and what you guys want me to react to. And also, go on my channel to look at my videos if you want to see more reaction videos from me. If you like my videos, click the subscribe button. Alright, so I'm out.